Hello Pisces, welcome to Beauty Tree Tarot and this reading is from 11th of September to 17th of September. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Pisces. What you can expect in this week. Eight of Pentacles. Knight of Swords. Ten of Swords. And Ace of Wands in reverse. So here we have Ten of Swords. Pisces, looks like um, you're going to a phase where you feel that everything is um, falling apart. You may be feeling a lot of pain, you may be feeling like life is going nowhere and um, whatever you are asking for is actually, you know, turning out to be a curse or you can say whatever you are choosing at this point is actually betraying you with this Ace of Wands in reverse. You may have this feeling that um, whatever you thought was real is actually fake and uh, you might be stuck in a toxic relationship, Pisces. Okay, it's like you always wanted this person, you felt like um, this was your only love and this is going to heal you, this is going to help you, this is going to make you strong. But actually this love is breaking you down. In fact, it's not even love. I mean, in its purest form. This person you are dealing with is Knight of Swords. This person feels like um, they can control everything or they can make you do the things they want. It's like uh, they are thinking about themselves only. Here they are being self-centered. They are only concerned about their um, own future. And uh, with this Eight of Pentacles, this could have something to do with money or work. This person is focusing too much on work or they have other priorities in their life. They are only focused about their future. You know, they may be starting a new project or this could be about something else, but it may be connected with money, but not necessarily. This could be about anything that they find interesting, that they love doing, and they feel like they need more space. They might be telling you that you are not giving them space, you are constantly complaining, you are looking for a lot of attention. So the problem is with you, not with them. Do not trust that. Pisces, that's not true. You are thinking too seriously, you are taking their words too seriously. This person is focused on something else. They feel like love can wait and, you know, it shouldn't be a priority in life. This person is thinking about uh, enjoying their life. They are thinking about uh, other things because they are taking you for granted. They feel like this love will always be there. They can take their time or you can say they can ignore you for a while and then they will come back. You will be there waiting for them. They are taking you for granted. They feel that this can work this way. Also, Eight of Pentacles uh, is about some kind of uh, business. I mean, they might be quite busy with what they are doing and uh, they feel like they cannot uh, walk away from this responsibility or from this dream that they always wanted to fulfill. So there is something that you cannot see but suddenly this person is being ignored, they're not giving you enough time and you know, they might be blaming it all on you like you are someone who is looking for extra attention or you are someone who just cannot 
do on your own. You need them for everything. You are weak emotionally and um, you need some kind of support. Do not trust this. This person is simply looking for excuses when they are supposed to take their responsibility. A lot of swords in your reading. Probably you are dealing with an air sign. Though of course, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Magician in reverse. Four of Pentacles in reverse. The world. of wands in reverse so here we have the magician in reverse seems like you feel that the magic is fading away this relationship is no more like uh, you know it used to be it's like this person has changed completely you just cannot believe that you are dating the same person or you are in this relationship for such a long time and um, you know, you are here with them, still here with them, in spite of all those challenges. You might be feeling that this person has changed completely and still looks like you are trying to hold your thoughts with this four of pentacles in reverse. The tarot is telling you, do not suppress your feelings. Do not uh, try to hold your feelings. It's like, uh, let everything come out. Let this person be aware of what you are thinking. Let this person know what the boundaries are. Maybe you feel like um, you can deal with it alone. You can deal with the Ten of Swords alone. You don't uh, need to express yourself. If you suppress these feelings, these feelings will be gone. No, it will come again and again. It's like um, you are just hiding something under the carpet. You are not destroying it. So whenever you will, you know, See beneath the carpet, the problems will still be there. So it's like, um, do not ignore your problems. It's, it's about facing those problems. And most importantly, you should discuss this with this person. With this world, seems like um, you have got everything, but you are unable to recognize because of the issues in your life. The tarot is telling you that your spirit is giving you everything. The universe is supporting you. You have got everything. You just need to make a decision. Once you choose to protect yourself, once you choose to fight for yourself, everything will fall in line and the universe is going to give you all the strength. Maybe you will feel a bit lower, you will feel like you are losing everything, but it's temporary. Okay, and uh, you will come out of it victorious. And here we have two of wands in reverse. I mean, it's weird. At one point, you might be feeling like you can handle it all on your own. You can deal with this feeling. And in the very next moment, you will feel like you are losing control. You just cannot deal with it anymore. You may be feeling like you need help, but you are unable to ask for because in the very next moment, you feel like, okay, I can be strong, I can handle this. It's not about being strong, Pisces. It's about uh, letting this person know how hurt you are and uh, how concerned you are. Okay, let's check an oracle message for you. Greet the darkness. Here where the spine bends and the mouth quivers, breathes the hidden, the pieces that make you whole but cut deep with all of their sharp edges. So it's about greeting the darkness. As I said that you might be feeling that you can run away from your feelings, you can run away from the darkness, 
but it's time to face it it's time to um, allow yourself to you know look into the unknown because uh, without that you cannot come up with a solution and uh, it's time to find something real okay so just face your fears know how you feel and what you want and then tell this to this person as well so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye